Hi everybody and welcome back to another landscape photography video adventure vlog. Today's going to be an interesting one. I am meeting my friend Jeremy and a friend of his that is visiting from the United States who's never been to Europe before. And we are taking our motivation, our drive, our itch to get out and using it to go out in what are probably some of the worst conditions that I can imagine to try and go do some landscape photography. We are going to go up to a mountain pass called Col du Macheru because there is a seven kilometer trail that goes to the highest point in the Jura Mountains. The point is called Mont Tendre. Now, I may not have, get any amazing images. It may be miserable, but I'm gonna go nonetheless and try to make the best of it. And there's part of me that's like, wait, awful conditions, snow, cold, sounds awesome. I feel like anytime I get a chance to like be in like a gritty winter environment, I can't help but get a little bit excited. It's just nice to have like, have the protective gear on and feel like I'm on a real adventure. So, all right, I'm looking forward to it no matter what. See you guys in the car. All right, so uh, we made it up to the Col, Col du Macharou. We get to park here at this uh, sort of big hotel, which also has food. I'm here with Mariella right here, and then Jeremy. We're just about geared up, and it is it is sleeting. I guess you'd call it snow. It is it is sleeting, snowing quite heavily. Um, but things look like we're going to be able to get to the trail, and so kind of just no expectations, you know, just. Going out there, hopefully we'll be able to find some wintry landscapes um, and make the best of it. So I will see you guys shortly on the trail. We're gonna get moving. Alright, so we've been walking about, oh, an hour and a half maybe, maybe closer to two hours, and we managed to get out of the dense forest. Saw some interesting compositional opportunities there, but obviously, they're really like, a ton of trees, it's, you, you really have to look small, and it's definitely more difficult. Uh, but I want to walk you through what I have now. Um, behind me, they're taking photos, <laughs> but right up here, there's a lone tree. Uh, sort of situated in, in between these really tall, I don't know what else to call them, evergreen trees. Big, these big, maybe they're pine, I'm not sure. Um, let me switch over to in-camera view for a moment here and you can see it. So, this is kind of the composition that I'm going with, making this small tree. Oh, the weather is just not great. I mean, the wind is really picking up right now and I'm just getting pelted in the face with snow. It's getting all over my camera. Um, but I'm going to probably try a couple of different focal lengths. I'm going to try 70, probably 135, and then I might even try 200. So what I'm going for is a very simple composition, and I want to try as much as I can to capture the texture. If I lower the exposure, you can kind of see the texture in the snow. See, let's go ahead and take an exposure here at 70. I need to recompose just a bit here. Let me move something just like this. Okay, so this is 70. Let's see here how it looks at 100. Okay, and for those wondering, I'm shooting all of these right now at F10. This is 30 seconds, or 30th of a second ISO 100. So 
So back to camera view, I'm going from 100 to 135. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and then zoom in now and I'm gonna to go to 200. I know you barely see me, just knowing everything. My buddy's trying to give me microfiber cloth. Switch to a video shot here. I think that looks fine. I wanna double check my focus. One more 10 second timer. Got your hands cold? I have man Mine are hands. freezing already. You have what? Man hands. Okay. Hard heart of those. <laughs> Very rare. And then I want to hear which composition you liked best and why. Because, you know, I really like hearing the opinions of other photographers because, you know, some people have a creative eye and they see something I haven't even considered yet. All right, so that's gonna almost do it for our walk. Hopefully we'll have enough time to enjoy a hot chocolate uh, at the hotel where we parked and I'll have enough time to make it back in time to shift back into dad mode and spend time with my lovely family. All right, everybody, I am signing off. This is not the cafe. We ran into some major traffic on the way back into town. And my little guy down here, <laughs> he, he needs my attention. So I just wanted to say thank you for watching. I haven't seen the pictures yet. I hope that they are as minimalistically great as I hope they will be. I'm looking forward to editing the video and hearing from you guys what you think. Until then, talk to you guys later and bye for now. Oh, that was not smart. I tried to get all the snow off of my lens. Oh boy. Hey Jeremy.